Hi, and welcome. I'm Shauna Huber, and I'm joined here with Jennifer Crawley, my co-author in the Life Care Management Handbook. And we're joined by Ray Lynn Christensen, one of our uh, guest contributors in the book. And I'm so excited to be here today. Just one of the benefits of starting your own business is you get to hang out during the day like this. We're joined in Helena, Montana, which is where Ray Lynn has her cattle branch. And she, we were just talking about how she gets to work outside in this beautiful weather um, for her business. So I'd like to do a little introduction to Ray Lynn and a little bit about her background. And then we're going to do a Q&A with yeah. Ray Lynn so that you can learn how to um, maybe get some inspiration for starting your own business. So Ray Lynn began her RN career 29 years ago, working full time in the hospital setting in conjunction with owning her own business in the healthcare industry all while raising a family and helping run a ranch. So a lot of things going on there. With a spirit for exploring new nursing ideas and career avenues, she founded Rocky Mountain Legal Nurse Consulting, Inc. in 2004. She was uh, asked to do a life care plan for a patient, and from there she was hooked. She pursued her certification in life care planning through Kaplan University, allowing her to truly help patients recover from a catastrophic injury and illness and go on to live quality of life and the care that they deserve. She founded Integrity Nurse Consulting and Life Care Planning in 2008 and expanded her practice to life care planning and medical cost projections, utilizing her nursing experience and the nursing process. And then in 2017, Raylan began assisting with patients that require the expertise of a registered nurse to oversee facilities and their care to promote better outcomes and quality on a continual basis. And that inspired her to add care management to her practice. And again, she's the co-author of the life care, or not co-author, I'm sorry, one of the contributors to the life care management practice. So I'm going to let them um, introduce themselves and we'll go from there. Welcome. I'm, I'm, hi, Shauna. I'm Jennifer Crowley, and I love being here on Ray Lynn Christian's Ranch. And Ray Lynn, it's been a long time. Yeah. Um, Ray Lynn has uh, been a mentor to me. She introduced me to life care planning and you, you've been an integral part of my success and I want to thank you. Oh. And I think it's so awesome that so many years later we're able to sit down here together um, and we're still busy in our own practices and um, we've got your cattle ranch, the beautiful cattle ranch in Helena, Montana in the background. We have a beautiful pre-spring day. So it's awesome. <laughs> so Welcome. Well, thank to you. This and thank you for sitting down with us. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So both um, Sean and I are life care planners as background. We're registered nurses, but we both have certification in life care planning. Um, we know what that means, but is there anything that you can tell the viewers to help them understand what life care planning entails? Well, uh, thank you for having me, Jen. Um, I am so honored to be here and to be a contributor in your book. I am so excited about your book. I just want to put that in there. Um, I haven't got to read it yet, and I just can't wait. And I know we're going to be able to utilize this in so many ways. So thank you. Um, but yeah, life care planning is is such a wonderful experience. It's such a wonderful um, addition to nursing and to you know, owning your own business and being able to do some of the things for your patients that you may have constraints in, in, in other areas of nursing or places that you work. So um, basically, you know, as in a nutshell, and I, I know you guys know this, but for the viewers, you know, we are allowed, we have patients that might have a catastrophic injury or illness. Um, most of them do. Um, and depending on which area of the body, uh, we look at them holistically and we're asked to do a life care plan on, on them, which is an assessment, uh, involves an assessment, reading their medical records, getting to know them um, really on a pretty personal basis. And then uh, working with their providers, their physicians, and, and utilizing evidence-based practice to form uh, some future care costs for them, figure out what their future care is going to be, put it in a plan, and then present it and then um, and and make that something that they can utilize for the rest of their life. Of course, it's going to be adjusted here and there, but that's really what it is. Um, we're able to use our nursing skills and utilize the nursing process in the means in, in all of this. So that's really what it is um, working with 
patients that have illness and, and injuries that are catastrophic. Yes. It's uh, pretty comprehensive. So we know not all life care managers are certified as a life care planner, uh, but we, it follows a, a lot of the key principles of uh, the care management follows a lot of the key principles of life care planning, where we're doing a we're looking at the individual wholly. Um, we're using uh, standards of care and evidence based practice. Mm -hmm. um, we're kind of projecting what the needs are and, and trying to figure out how to go about connecting that individual and making a person centered care plan. And right. a lot of care managers um, end up, you know, the vast majority of them will be nurses and social workers. We know that there's a lot of care managers have diverse backgrounds. Um, so just thought it was really mm -hmm. neat for us to sit down together, being that we are certified life care planners as well, but also now we offer care management as part mm -hmm. of our, as part of our practice. And so um, what made you decide to own your own business? Just curious. Like, well, you know, I working in the hospital setting in other settings, you know, for a long time, I just wanted to do more. I wanted to be able to um, provide a, a more care for the patient and follow that through. You know, once they leave the hospital, you don't know what happens to them and you know they're going to need that assistance. So that's really what motivated me is to be able to uh, be more in control and use my nursing skills and use my rehabilitation skills and just me uh, caring for patients and people, I'm able to do that if I have my own business. Mm -hmm. And as you might guess, I'm here on this, our ranch, uh, we've ranched our whole life. And so, yeah. you know, I, it's kind of a family um, affair too, you know, being able to schedule your, your business around mm -hmm. what's important, mm -hmm. which is your family. Flexibility. Um, so the flexibility mm -hmm. and, and it's a challenge, but I, I wouldn't do it any other way. So that's being your own boss can be challenging at times. Yeah. So would you say there's any big challenges that you've experienced along the way or any tips that mm -hmm. you can give anybody considering starting their own care management or consulting right. practice or seeking certification in some of these disciplines? Mm -hmm. Well, um, you, you, when you say any challenges, oh, where do I begin? <laughs> um, but I won't, I won't yeah. go into all of them. But you know, yeah, absolutely. Owning your own business is, is not for the weak. Mm -hmm. It is a big challenge. And it's, it's a lot of um, healthcare for people. Uh, I think they think, you know, I'm just constrained to this one area that I work now. You are, you're so, we're such an integral part of uh, our experience. We need to get it out there and use it. Um, and so owning your own business, um, it, it involves you're a, you're a bookkeeper, you're a organizer, you are a motivator, you are besides the practice that you're doing, helping your patients, you're all these other things. And there's a lot of time we put in that is not paid. Mm -hmm. You have to be willing to do that. Mm -hmm. And um, so, you know, and then getting certified in life care planning, that was a big, big hurdle for me. Mm -hmm. um, but I, I, you know, through a lot of studying and a lot of determination, I did it. And mm -hmm. you have to take the big test, but I, I, uh, you know, that that's, I just chose um, Kaplan University just on recommendations back when I got certified. Mm -hmm. Now they have nurse certifications. They have all kinds of opportunity and anybody can do this. I really believe that. Mm -hmm. um, you just have to believe in your, I think the biggest challenge is believing in yourself. Sure. Yeah. For me. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. Good. So Raylan, I have a question. So you contributed mm -hmm. to our chapter in the Life Care Management Handbook. And the yeah. chapter was called Diversifying for Sustainability. So we have different contributors that show how you have a care management practice, and then you can add different things to um, mm -hmm. your practice to be successful. And because you're a nurse by trade and also a life care planner who's added care management services, you probably understand how valuable the care manager can be in many situations. So do you feel like most people understand what a care manager is and what they do? And if not, how do you describe in short to people what a care manager is? Yeah, you know, that's, that is a good question. Um, I would have to say, just based on my own personal experience, and then nurses that I've worked with, mm -hmm. especially in, in the hospital setting or the healthcare setting, no, I don't think people really do understand what a care manager is. I was just telling Jen, we were talking before this interview, um, there's so many different names, you know, that can go with it. People title it so many, so much differently. And I feel 
care man the word care management what comes to mind to me is now we can um, take our you know it complements life care planning first of all um, in my opinion we're, you know care management is is managing someone's managing someone's care yeah. it's self-explanatory uh, where you know so I feel when I when I saw you guys um, developing your book and this and expanding on this um, entity care management I was so excited because it fits right into what we nurses and I'm sure other healthcare professionals are going to and, and doctors are going to understand um, you know, it's, it's simple. We want to, we want to provide the care that that life care plan or whatever, maybe it isn't a life care plan, but care management goes right alongside of it. But I think there's going to need to be some, some education for us nurses that, um, that you guys are going to provide that I'm very excited about that. So I don't know if that answers your question, but, um, you know, I expanding my practice, I didn't know if I could do it. The word yeah. case management kind of scares me. Yeah. <laughs> I think, you know, I have to know so many different things where care management, I can slide right into it and I do it. Yeah. So um, it's just what we do naturally anyways. Mm -hmm. And if we don't know how to do it, we figure it out. We find the entities, to, the people to help us do yeah. that. Well, thanks for visiting with us today. Yeah, it's absolutely. really amazing. I, I really can tell like the, you know, the success you've had and you've been able to meld it into your life here, raising mm -hmm you know, on a ranch mm -hmm. in Montana, raising cattle and your kids are now adults, uh, you know, making yeah. their own lives. So yeah, um, absolutely. It's uh, thank it's, you for having me. Yeah, uh, this is quite an honor. So um, how can um, listeners or viewers um, get in touch with you if they want to just maybe there's something that's, you know, struck with what you said, um, they just want to reach out. Is that okay? Yeah, absolutely. That? Um, yeah, absolutely. Anytime. Um, I'm always I love visiting with other people that want to get their business started or know what we do in our industry because sometimes it can be confusing so just visiting is always is always great with me or questions or anything um so you know um my i have a website it's um www.integrityrn.com or um call me at 406-459-1324 or email me um at Integ Raylan at integrityrn.com. So awesome. There's thank many you. ways to get a hold of me, but thank yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. And thanks again for the important part you've had in my life yeah. and in my career. And thank you mm -hmm. for contributing um, to our book. And, um, yeah. you know, it really, it's been uh, really a pleasure to have you come alongside us in this project. So, well, Jen, I just, you, you kind of got me teary eyed in the beginning <laughs> of it. I, you just have been, you guys are amazing. So oh, I am thanks. so proud of you guys. <laughs> awesome. We're pretty excited, right, Shauna? Yeah. And um, we should just add to end, if you are interested in the book and learning how to um, be a care manager and what a care manager is, you can go to lcmexpert.com and purchase the book and get started. Okay. Thanks, Shauna. Thanks, you guys. All right. Thank you, Raylan. Thanks, Jennifer.